اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ٹوڈے ان شاء اللہ بائی دا گریس آف اللہ رب العزت وی شیل بی ڈوئنگ دا ٹویلتھ رکو آف سورہ علی عمران اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم You are the best nation raised up for mankind. You enjoin to right and forget, forbid from wrong. And you believe in Allah. And if the people of the scripture had believed, it would have been better for them. Among them are believers and most of them are disobedient. They will never harm you except a trifling hurt. And if they fight against you, they will turn on their backs. Then afterwards, they will not be helped. Humiliation has been laid over them by Allah wherever they are found except for a rope covenant from Allah and a rope treaty from the people and they have drawn on themselves the wrath of Allah and the destitution is laid upon them. That is because they used to disbelieve in the revelations of Allah and killed the prophets without right. That is because they disobeyed and used to transgress. They are not alike among the people of the scripture. There is a community standing right. They recite the verses of Allah during the hours of the night and they prostrate. They believe in Allah and the last day and they enjoin to right and they forbid from wrong. And they hasten one another in good deeds and those are among the righteous. And whatever of good they do, never will it be, will it be rejected of them and Allah is all aware of those who fear him. Certainly, those who disbelieve, neither their wealth nor their children will avail them against Allah at all. And they are the dwellers of fire. They will abide therein. The example of that which they spend in this life of the world is as the example of a wind with frost in it. We struck the harvest of a people who have wronged themselves, then destroyed it. And Allah wronged them not. But they do wrong to themselves. For you who believe, do not take as intimates other than among yourselves. They would not spare you any ruins. They love that which distress you. Indeed, the hatred appears by the utterance of their mouth, and that which their breasts hide is even greater. We have certainly made plain for you the revelations, if you will understand. Here you, are, here you are those, you love them and they do not love you and you believe in all the scriptures and when they meet with you and they say, we believe and when they are alone, they bite their fingertips at you in rage, say, die in your rage, certainly Allah is all aware of what is in the breasts. If any good happens to you, it grieves them and if any misfortune befalls you, they rejoice at it and if you are patient and fear Allah, their plot will not harm you at all. Surely Allah is surrounding that which they do. Wa akhir dawana anilhamdulillahi rabbil alameen.